Hey guys, this is Rome. I just wanted to give you guys a quick walkthrough of our progress here at the studio thus far. As I told you before, and many of you that are following us on Facebook and Twitter, uh, Model Mayhem, things like that, as you know, we've been working on getting the two areas set up and separated. So as you can see here, we have the boudoir glamour area almost completed. There are a few little ends that we're still waiting on to come in. The lighting can switch from room to room, so it doesn't really matter which lights are in here at the particular moment. You know, anyone using the studio space can move, you know, lights from the other area on the opposite side back over here anytime they like. Uh, we have the small area set up here dedicated for makeup. So we have our airbrush makeup. We have a ton of different hues, skin tone, colors. As you guys can see, we're pretty well stocked where it comes to uh, the airbrush makeup. So what we have done so far in the opposite room, this is more of our commercial print room. So we have a number of lights still here on the floor. We have the desk area set up. I should be bringing the iMac back over here to the studio pretty soon. Uh, just temporarily, I've been using my MacBook. It works, you know, just fine over here. We have the new addition of the uh, Profoto lights. And pretty much that's it for what we've done inside of the space. So it really just depends on, you know, what one would use the space for. Like I said, if it's for glamour, if it's for boudoir, this side would be ideal. You know, even this wooden door here lends to a really nice backdrop, you know, when shooting. <clears throat> I found this paneling uh, here recently that kind of gives it a wood look. And these can be moved very simply. You can just pick them up. They're very, very ultra light and you can reposition them however you like. So you could expand the area that you're shooting in if you want more of that wood look on the floor, that wood grain look, something like that.